Welcome to this video. My name is Stefan Juchmes and I want to show you today how you install the MBS plugin for FileMaker client on your Windows. We download the plugin from the website of MonkeyBread software. The URL is www.monkeybreadsoftware.com. We find the MBS FileMaker plugin in the tab FileMaker plugin. Down here you see the download section. We can choose between two data formats. We have zip archive and the Apple Disk image. Both packages have the exact same content. We choose the zip archive. With a click we start the download. This can take a few minutes. Meanwhile I show you the documentation. Therefore we click on the tab Function Reference. Now we see the components of the MBS FileMaker plugin. If we click on one of these components, we get a list of all functions in this component. In the individual function, we find a description about this function. Here you can see the platforms on which the function can be used. Here you see how to call this function in combination with, with its parameters. In the table we find information about each parameter in detail. Also we see what the function returns. Here we see a more detailed description about what the function does and on which point we need to pay attention. Often you will find an example here that shows you how to use this function in a project. This documentation is a very helpful tool for working with the MBS functions. After the download completes, we open it. We see the content of the zip archive. Additional to the plugin, the folder contains the documentation and an example folder with a lot of examples that you can use in your solutions. Here we have the plugin for different platforms. Today we want to use the Windows plugin. We perform a double click on the folder and we see that we have a 32-bit and a 64-bit plugin file. But we don't need to think about which file we need to copy to FileMaker because we can copy both files. Then we start FileMaker. In the Preference dialog, in the tab Plugins, we click the button Reveal Plugin Folder. The folder opens and we pass the plugin files. Then we close FileMaker and we open it. Then we go to the preferences again. We see that the MBS plugin is activated as it has a check checkbox. If you have a license for the MBS FileMaker plugin, you got the license code by mail. The mail will look similar. If you want to use the license in all your projects, you open the data viewer. and write the following line or you copy it from the mail. MBS store registration, the licensee name, the component, license type, expire months and then the serial number. On our website you can apply for a trial license. Click on trial license in the navigation and complete the form. The trial license is only working for a few weeks. Please don't sell or deliver solutions with this trial license. After we check and approve your trial license, we send you an email with the license key and the other information. You also can test all functions without a trial license. We create a new project and open the script workspace. We add a new script to the project. We give it a new name. In the script step section, we see a script step MBS plugin. 
In this script, we want to get the version of the plugin in a customer dialog. The version of the plugin can be seen in the preference dialog, but the function is useful, for example, for auto updates. At first, we set a variable. Because we want the result value of this function. In the value, we edit the MBS function. We start every MBS function with the call of the function MBS. Then, as the first parameter, we set the function name as a text. If we have more parameters, we add them separate by semicolons behind the function name. But this function doesn't use more parameters and we click OK. We can show the customer dialog and get the variable as result text. We save our script and run it. We have version 9.5.0 with build number 9. If you have questions about the MBS FileMaker plugin, you can visit the FAQ section on our website or write us an email. We look forward to help you. I wish you a lot of fun with the MBS FileMaker plugin. Thank you for watching this video.